We're going to be talking about strategic alignment, then we'll give you an overview of the research that we base the findings on. The first part is uh, to understand a, this concept called strategic alignment. And we did some, or HR Coach did some research um, early last decade, so it was actually 15 years ago, on 5,000 businesses in Australia and found that some businesses have high levels of strategy, that's to the top of the, uh, the box, and some businesses have a low level of strategy. The research also identified high strategy, low activity, top left quadrant, more typical of a startup business, and businesses with no, low activity, low strategy, bottom left quadrant, are danger exiting the market, more typical of second and third generation businesses. So this research, way back in 2003, um, uh, uh, crystallised this model, and then um, what made it really useful is the research identified which quadrants are businesses in. 48% of Australian businesses, small to medium sectors, sat in the bottom right. 22% top right, 14% startups, 16% danger of exiting. Our own experience since this research was done is that um, uh, businesses that are in the red zone, it's not sustainable. If you lose a couple of key people, those businesses move across to the left-hand side and exit the market. Uh, the, the challenge is you've got to get yourself to the top right because that's the spot where you're going, your business is going to be sustainable and profitable. And the, ch the bigger challenge is once you get there, you can't stop. We found these five questions or statements and scores were greater than 50% gap between low-performing businesses and high-performing businesses. Once we sorted out the quartiles and the low and highs, we found these five things were driving the gap, were, were, were owned the majority of the gap between low and high-performing businesses. This is significant research. We only completed this research last year. Managers and their style and their teams align with the style of their manager. So in this one, management and employee culture are core to strategic alignment. So you've got to measure it. <music>